All right, so a lot of people say, Are you well, guys doing this for class? What kind of class would say, you're classless. I don't, I don't know. know. Leave your class that makes people feel you bad. You actually randomly do this and you're just doing it? Look, the point is, <laughs> That those guys said, huh, now that you're the best, I guess you're trying to compete or something. But I said, I never compete because when I used to have an ox, I would carry the ox on my back sometimes. Because why should the ox do all the work? So then this evil witch came and said, I don't like the friendship you and this ox have. I find it unnatural and against the values of society. Why do you love this ox so much? You want to marry this ox? Well, you can't marry this ox because I'm going to make it illegal. Plus, I'm going to beat you two guys up and make you guys my slaves. And I said, you can't make Jesus. me and my ox your slave. We're animals. Well, I'm not an animal, but we're not going to be slaves anyway, is what I said. Guys. Oh my god! <laughs> no one will ever. No! Well, if they yeah. say that, it's only because everyone's gathered the ring. Where everyone go? Well, I guess they got scared by how cool I am and they ran away. How they old are you? Huh? You? Well, you know, like mid to late 20s or 30s. I wasted my life a long time, but then I saw Zach Efron no, se really. in how 17 again. Well, I feel like I'm 17 again. Because back when I was 17, I was taking, you want to be there I was taking, <laughs> join the movie. It's a movie about biology, which I was taking <laughs> when I was 17. Just like Zac Efron. Zac Efron, guy, girl, she is pregnant. out of here. And then, oh, you know, I know the fat girl that Zac Efron loves. What's her name? Fatty McFat Fat? God damn it, I know her name. It's, um... I was in the fire department with her in, in 8th grade science and she called me lazy. Uh, by, her name escapes me at the moment. God damn it. She was in a lot of fat girl movies where she plays the fat girl. They even made a series about where she's fat and she's got to compete in this beauty contest. No, no, that, that was it. That was one for Lifetime movies. The other movie was the one where she was fat. Yeah, I have told you the time in college that I was watching the slasher film on Lifetime. And, and I saw it was so cool that I was watching the slasher film. And these girls walk in on me and they go, Oh, it's a boy watching Lifetime alone. And they saw some kind of guy who watches Lifetime alone crying and eating ice cream. I was only watching Lifetime because it's a slasher film. And I wanted to see they don't the have slasher. slasher film. Well, I mean, there's like, it seemed like she was scared or something. There's like scary music. And stuff because you know the thing about slasher films is teenagers with their loud music, their long hair, their garfield, their, their fast cars, and their hot <laughs> teen oh, sex are making everyone pissed off. So sometimes people become slashers and slash teenagers yeah, in the movie me. theaters I go to. Everyone totally cheers because everyone hates teenagers so much. So how can you blame people who become slashers and clean up society's problems? Like that will teach those teenagers not to rock and roll so hard all the time. Alright, anyway, back to my ox. You know, so my ox was falling behind me because I was pulling so much and the ox was like, I can't handle this, I can't handle this. And then whammo, I came and I helped the ox carry his side of the, por of the portion. So everyone won. Alright, that's a wrap. And since for signing my, my form to join my movie. Wait, for for not it. signing. Can I know? I want to sign it. Can I sign it? Shut it off, shut it off.